When it comes to detecting breast cancer, mammography is the gold standard. In today's HealthCast Local 10's Christy Krueger shows us how the accuracy of this common screening can be improved through technology. Well, it's one of the best ways to find breast cancer, of course, and according to the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention, 65% of women have had a mammogram in the past two years. And while the screenings can detect cancer at its very early stages, there's always a chance that something may get overlooked. And that's where Anna Betsy Rivero hopes to make a huge difference. While earning her master's degree in computer science right here at Nova Southeastern University, Rivero created a software program to improve the accuracy of breast cancer diagnosis. It can detect microscopic changes pixel by pixel in mammogram imaging. The human eye is very, very good at determining patterns, but what happens is that some of these patterns are microscopic. It's very difficult for the human eye to detect differences at the pixel level. And these programs have that granularity to be able to determine that in real time, allowing the doctors to practice more patient-centric medicine rather than spending hours behind the screen looking for these patterns. Rivera hopes to have her program in use by this time next year. Also in today's health news, more data linking the benefits of exercise in preventing dementia, especially for women. Researchers studied women who had low, medium, and high levels of fitness and found that those who exercised the most had later onset of dementia by as much as nine years compared to other groups. And this study, of course, continues to underscore the importance of physical activity as we age, confirming that what's good for our heart is probably also pretty good for our brain. With your HealthCast today, I'm Christy Krueger.